Remember when Sidney Lowe got canned last offseason as head coach of the Wolfpack? Sure, he deserved to get fired, but the guy that Wolfpack fans expected to come in was supposed to be some sort of sexy hire that national media thought was completely unrealistic. Rick Barnes, Sean Miller, some are from out of the sky. It was almost laughable. But Mark Godfrey, what he has done in his first season, he has proven to be the adequate coach for this job as the Wolfpack advanced to the Sweet 16 in year one of the Godfrey regime with a 66-63 victory over Georgetown. The Wolfpack played great today, especially on the offensive end. They didn't shoot the ball well. They had balanced scoring down low and up on the perimeter as four guys finished in double figures, five guys finished with at least nine points, and C.J. Leslie was one of three players with 14 points. He is one of the best sophomores in the country in terms of pure talent, but he's been inconsistent. Today, he showed that he can do it at both ends of the court. He was good down low. He hit a couple jumpers. He had some big key blocks, especially in the second half. Some good steals to end the half in the first half. He was really fun to watch, and I think it's got to be really appealing for Wolfpack fans to see him play like that. The future is really bright for this program. They get to the Sweet 16 in year one of Godfrey's tenure. They have a great recruiting class coming in, so really, you got to be pretty psyched if you're in Raleigh Durham right now, especially with Duke. They've already been eliminated. For the Hoyas, this is the third year in a row that they've been bounced by a double-digit seed in the NCAA tournament, and that's got to really concern Hoya fans. It's actually been for the last four tournament bids that they've been in, that they've been bounced by a double-digit seed. So that that really stinks. You know, George uh, John Thompson III, he's a great coach, really a defensive-minded coach. This Hoyas team specifically this year was really focused on defense. They've had to play from behind today, and that really is not something that suits them well. Jason, or excuse me, Hollis Thompson is a good player, maybe not a great player. He led all scores today with 24 points. I was impressed with his shooting, but at the same time, I thought a lot of his teammates took some really poor shots. The shot selection from both Thompson and his teammates were poor. Could have really, you know, worked the ball around a little bit more. Even that last play as the buzzer sounded with Jason Clark hurling up a three. I got to think there was something else in the works there. Maybe maybe somehow get the ball to Thompson first shot. But that was not the look that they were looking for. Regardless of what happened, the Wolfpack advance to the Sweet 16. They'll play the winner of Kansas or Purdue. Be sure to subscribe by hitting the button below or above. I'm not sure where they're putting it right now. Be sure to subscribe to the YouTube channel for SB Nation.